Hi guys, this is Elise and I'm here with a project share and a small Sizzix haul. Um, I said that I was going to be doing other things other than my journal to share with you guys, um, like making cards, making tags, and that's exactly what I did. I made a card and I made a few tags. So I wanted to share those with you guys and then I'm going to show you the um, other dies that I received from the second half of my Sizzix um, sale haul. So um, let me show you what I used first okay so first of all i use this paper here and this is the mary mary paper um stack by pebbles i love this paper it's really really cute and festive i love that green look how pretty that green um sparkle paper is that glitter paper it's really really adorable paper and i'm going to try this year to do as many projects as possible using up some of this paper because it's really really cute and i really want to use up the things that i have so that was my goal when i you know said that i was going to be doing more things using the things that i have and the way for me to do that to use up some of the things in my room is to start making more cards more tags more other types of projects other than journals because everything can't go in my journal so I also use this Stamping Up um, ink, and this is the Baked Brown Sugar. Okay, I used, and I didn't clean off my desk, guys. I apologize. I used this stamp set um, that was introduced to us by Jill. Hi, Jill. Jill Norwood. And Jill is the queen of making Christmas tags, along with Mario. Hi, Mario. And so I'm going to dedicate this first tag to Jill and Mario. So anyway, this is my Lily of the Valley stamp set. I do have, I'm missing a couple, but I do have them around here somewhere. Um, and let's see, what else did I use? I used, um, let's see, what else did I use? I used some twine, this twine here, and then I use a new Sizzix die. It is this die right here, and this is the bear. It's really, really cute. It's by Laura Kate, and this came out this year, and it's absolutely adorable. There are lots of pieces that you have to cut, so it was a little time-consuming making these tags, but I got them done, and I think they turned out really, really cute. So let me show you what I did. So first of all, I made a card. Well, let me show you the tags first. Okay, so these are my Christmas bears. Here's the first one. And for this one, um, I added this little um, gift bow. And then I added a Santa hat. And I got a bunch of these Santa hats last year at the end of the season um, for after Christmas from Hobby Lobby. They had... for. I was really surprised to find like four or five packs of these and I got them for like 30, 33 cents or something like that. So I have a ton of these. So I put one of those little hats on each one of my little bears. Look how cute. I use some twine. There's one of those Lily of the Valley um, tags. And so that's my first little Santa bear. Here's the second one. Now I could have made all of the little scarfs, um, different uh, colors and patterns, but I just went ahead and just punched a bunch of the same. So they all have the same little scarf and they all have the little Santa hat. But this one is holding a little wreath. So adorable. And this one here, this is so cute. I love this. He's holding a cup of hot cocoa and this is a Pebbles die cut piece. And I don't think it's the Mary Mary collection. This came from the collection that came out last year. I'm not sure what it's called. I can't remember. But anyhow, I know you've, you guys have seen that. But it's really, really adorable. And this one says Christmas cheer. And then here is the next one. Look how adorable. I think this is my favorite one. This is actually a sticker. It comes in a pack. You get like, this is the last one that I have. You get like, I think six in a pack of these little strings of lights. And I think that turned out so adorable. Look how cute. I think that's my favorite one so cute and then here is this one and he's holding a, hand, a candy cane and i actually bent back his little hand to make it look like he's actually holding that candy cane and this is actually vintage this is a really old um i got these this pack of candy canes they're picks i got a pack of these from an antique store and they were really old um but i have a bunch of those so i thought that was really really cute so i used one of those and then the last one is this one. I just love these little Christmas bears. So here's the other one. 
And this one says Christmas cheer as well. And he's holding a little uh, glitter gingerbread man. So adorable. So these, like I said, these took a little bit of time to make because you've got this, the die cut piece, the body, but then you've got these pieces here. You've got the nose and the little cheeks and the ears. It, it was a lot of little pieces to, to put together. So, so far I've only made six and then I made a card. And actually this is just a card front. And I'm going to actually put this on top of a card. But this is a card base that I made, a card front. And look how adorable that is. So cute. And this is a Lawn Fawn um, die that says hello. And again, I added the little Santa hat. And he's holding the string of lights because, like I said, that was my favorite one. So I wanted that one on top of the cards. So how cute is that? So again, this is the die that I used. And it's this bear, this large bear. He's really, really adorable. And these, you know, these are about the same size as the gingerbread. These are, let me see if I can tell you about how long they are. Three, four, these are about five inches long. About five inches tall. So really, really cute. So those are my Santa Bears. That's my card. And let me show you the other dies that I got because I did get a couple more dies. Um, I got this one. I love this. This is by Debbie Potter. I actually have a couple of her other um, dies. And this collection actually has been out for a few years now. And I actually have a couple other, couple more of the, the dies in the collection. But um, since these were only like, I think I got these for like maybe $5, maybe. If that, if not, if that, I think they might have been three or four dollars. And then here's the back. I just love the Scandinavian look. So I got that. I'm gonna have fun making some cards with that one. And then I got this one. This is also in that collection by Debbie Potter. And here it is. And they still, I think Sizzix, I'm not sure if their sale is over. I think it is. But um, and then I got this one. I thought this was really cute. This one makes the little um like a little gift card holder. You could put a little chocolate in there and you get the pieces to make the owl, I mean, excuse me, the bear or the little uh, Mrs. Claus. So that's adorable. I love that. Really, really cute. And then um, I love this one. This one is going to be so fun to play around with. So this is actually new as well. So I love this one. And here's how it looks. And this is the, here's the number if you're interested. So those are my new dies. And um, again, I use the Santa, the bear die. And these are my little Santa bears. And I'm hoping to make more tag tags. I'm not going to make any promises. But, um, so I'm not going to call this tag number one. Because that means that there's going to be more coming. So I'm not sure. So right now, this is just a tag and a card that I made. And I hope to um, share more tags. So these are really cute. So what I think I'm going to do is get some string and poke it and just hang some string here. And it can hang that way. So so very cute. So anyway, all right, guys. Thanks for watching. Leave some comments. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And leave me a thumbs up if you like this video and like my tags. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.